Hi, I'm Kylie and this is Creative 30. Today we've come to Deptford to meet knitwear designer Lyria Pristine. Described as a wall totem rebel for her adventurous use of yarn, Lyria has had her work featured in fashion publications in both the UK and in Europe. Tell us a little bit about where you're from originally. I grew up in Toronto, in Canada. When did you move over to London? About six years ago now. I kind of came a year before studying and decided that I want to go for fashion design and kind of the knitwear came about um, discovering, kind of creating a portfolio. So this is the knit machine I use, a domestic brother machine that I use for all the pieces. Um, it's not as complicated as it looks. I always have a different group of colour that I'm really excited about at a specific moment. But you just kind of, yeah, start threading it like that. I mean, the same kind of process as a sewing machine, I guess. <laughs> Where did you learn to use um, I guess I started learning at St. Martin's, um, where I studied. And, but they teach you very basic stuff in fashion design with knit. And they kind of, they leave you on your own to experiment and learn the techniques. Um, which I guess that's what brought me to where I am, just very experimental and always pushing the boundaries of knitwear. You don't I get influenced by people and designers like McQueen and Galliano and Victor and Rolf and Lacroix, but just kind of stays back here in a kind of library and then it just, it just kind of comes from you because it's just, you have to make every decision. You just don't walk into a fabric shop and say, I like that fabric. And you have to have it in red because it's only in red. This, you just, you could choose your color. You choose mm. just everything from scratch. What era do you think mainly influences you? I think, yeah, 20s, 30s, definitely. 20s to 50s, at least. I don't really find inspiration yet, at least in the 80s and 90s. Who are these people on the walls? The middle, in, that's my grandparents, and they're in a traditional Albanian costume. Who's the lady with the gun? That's my mother. <laughs> <laughs> it must have been a photo just taken for fun, I hope. <laughs> Where would you like to see yourself in the future with your knitwear? I think definitely working with performers and musicians and people that inspire me. But I definitely want to be having my own label. 